Firdaus says, what should a woman do if she has to choose between obeying her parents or her husband? Well, in the beginning, before marriage, a woman is obliged to obey her parents. So your father has a priority over you that you obey him as he is your guardian. But when a woman gets married, her guardian becomes her husband. And Allah Azza wa Jal ordered the women to obey their wife, to, to obey their husbands. And Allah described men to be guardians by saying, nisa." So Allah favored men over women. Because of that, they are guardians to be obeyed. And because of the money they provide for their wives, they must be obeyed. If we have a conflict of interest, a wife sitting in her husband's home, her father calls and says, I'd like you to come with me to such and such place. Or I want you to travel with me to such and such city. She asks her husband and the husband says, no, I don't permit that and I don't allow you to do that. So now she's at a crossroad. Should she obey her father while disobeying her husband? Or should she obey her husband and stay back while disobeying her father? There is no difference of opinion to my knowledge that she must obey her husband. Because the status of a husband over everyone else is so great to the extent that the Prophet said, والسلام, if I were to order someone to prostrate to another, I would have ordered a woman to prostrate to her husband. And he did not mention anything close as this regarding her father. So yes, she has to be dutiful to her father. She must be respectful and obedient as long as it does not go against her husband's commands and instructions. But if it does, then her husband has the priority. And even if her father curses her, does not speak to her, boycotts her, she must make that clear to him and to her mother that she has no other choice but to obey her husband as Allah has commanded. And Allah Azza wa Jal knows best.